Movie Shelter and today we'll do the unboxing of Anaconda Box from Mag Magnificent. So as you can see this is very deluxe, very limited box set from China that was supported by the Media Cycles in the international markets and this is pretty huge box. If we will compare it to normal Bray, you can see that it's just huge very big very unusual and very special so let's see how it looks like here is the pet slip on the box which can be taken off it's right now with a protective film on the downside as we can see we have written anaconda here are some uh, elements from the packing on the back we have the huge logo of the company so let's see what's inside Pet slip is very very big, protected with the foil. I will not take it out right now to protect it well for the time. On the top there is logo of Mag Magnificent. In the center there is this transparent eye of Anaconda. You may see it like that. Let's open the box. We can see that this uh, element is cut and off. You see the anaconda skin. Here is the imitation of the jungle. So with the bad slip it will look like that. So you can see that uh, skin of anaconda is beneath the eye. So it's, it's pretty cool. Probably without the protective film it even would be much nicer but uh, as I mentioned I don't want to take it off because there are some stickers and I didn't find the proper way to display it so far. The film comes the certificate from the mag. My number is 86 from 100. There is a logo of the edition and a sticker showing that it's a real thing. Text is in uh, Chinese and in English just to understand how big effort was to bring this edition to life So it's very nice nothing on the back There are some spot gloss elements from the jungle Which looks really really cool logo Number on the back as well here Okay, let's open that bad boy So here we have the eye, eye of Anaconda, which is really cool. I haven't seen editions with something like that before. Here we have the coin, which looks pretty nice. Quite, quite nice coin. I like it. It's not so heavy, but uh, still, I think that looks cool. And here we have the Anaconda edition. So here we have the Anacondas, because there is. Um, first film inside and there is a spot for the second one so if you have the spare edition of this movie and add the disc inside so here we have the place for it okay the cover is okay booklet, the journal, the expedition, all the information about the flowers and snakes in that area, which is nice, and some area for notes, adventure journal, and the orchid. Oh, 
on the postcards. On the back is like imitation of dirt. The box by itself, it's it's nice. I like the uh, this how they made this pattern of the anaconda. Whole lenticular effect. It's a little bit uh, computer made, but as far as I remember, it was the low budget sequel. So also the promotion materials were not so good. Beneath this part. See, there is Anaconda, the original one with the discs. Let's see this first box with necklace. The necklace is made from looks like wood and it's pretty cool. Pretty cool prop. So, you can see that uh, a lot of effort was put to the to this release and it's very nice you see that uh, still there are some companies that are trying to do something different so here is one edition of the anaconda and the second one that resembles uh, the edition for the second part so the first one is like this Everything is written in Chinese, but this is the classic Digipack. We have the J card. You can feel the title, however, it's not. It's only printed out. Okay, let's open it. So this font uh, is similar to the box one. Here we have the picture of the main cast. It's spot gloss and we can see the jungle. So inside we have the pictures and the jungle surrounding on the daily pack. On the back there is the similar, similar looking side like on the sequel. Here we have the disc, anaconda, Chinese letters and the jungle on the back. I think that here could be some more happening on this side, but uh, there is some kind of consistency with the picture on the disc, so still I think it's nice. The Diggy Pack is very sturdy, it's similar to media book covers, so I think that is pretty nice. Careful, not to damage. Card. And the boxes for the Anaconda. So I think the more deluxe one, and if you want to keep it the same as the second one. So here is the box for the disc. Back and the picture inside. The quality is not perfect for this one, in my opinion, but I think that the effect is like that to keep it uh, like it's dirty and used. The photos are black and white. Some kind of the dirt on them. And the booklet it's really nice spotless artwork. Something the anaconda. Mark and make this 
Ganze. Okay. And here we have some pictures of the anaconda itself. Not sure if those are from the movie, but maybe from National Geography. And on the back of this full slip we have lenticular effect in the jungle and the anaconda here chasing the, the ship. So I think that overall it's really cool addition. Not sure about the empty boxes idea, they all are quite nice. Uh, I think that this is just the chance that we can use the different options uh, for ourselves. That's what we want to keep our edition in. However, most of the collectors are just uh, mixing uh, editions inside, so for you to judge if you want to have such thing here or not. But uh, the overall box set uh, is really cool, it's huge, it's big and we can see how much attention was put into the details. So I think that for sure for Anaconda you will not find anything better than this one. And if you are the fan, especially for the first part, but maybe the whole quadrilogy, this is the one to get. And I believe this is one of the coolest sets I have seen uh, for the recent years. All those elements that uh, are making it special and wonderful. So thank you for your attention, see you soon and bye!